So you're lost, confused, or don't know which way in life to go. Either you have too many avenues available, or you have none at all. Or maybe you have one and want to expand to multiple ones. Either way, you're still lost, but you're found. You're not lost in the sense that you don't know what to do. You're lost in the sense of you don't know what's for you. You don't know what really fulfills you. You don't know what will really be your soul's purpose, in a sense. There's this quote I read a long time ago. It says, your future self is watching you through your memories. Now that means that every single second, every single thing you do is being collected and organized into your subconscious mind. In the future self, you will think about these days, you will think about these times, you will think about these emotions that you felt during what will be the past. But don't dwell on that. I'm not going to get into that. <laughs> I have a video for that. But yeah. To those who have so many paths yet don't know which one is for them. This is a heart to heart video because I'm amongst you. I have so many things I want to do. I have so many desires, so many goals, so many dreams, yet I don't know which one is for me. But I stand tall and I follow the one that follows my heart. I follow the one that my soul desires. Which is that? I don't know, but I guess I'm doing it, am I? I don't know. I like to talk and I like to help people out. I like to enlighten others. I like to speak to people's soul. I like to listen to people. That's just me. But back on track. We're not going to uh, drift off because of me. Okay, so let's collect everybody. Collect. <sighs> Shit. <laughs> But yeah, if you walk among this earth feeling lost, feeling like you're less of a person because you don't do something somebody else is doing or you or you feel less of a person because you're not pulling your own weight, don't look down on yourself. Do not feel bad about yourself. Do not. What you have to do is take that energy and really search within yourself and search so deep into yourself and uncover what is for you then again what is for you will find you what is for you will find you it will find you when you're not looking for it this is how the universe works when you're not searching for something when you're not craving something when you're not desiring something it will give you exactly what you need and it comes in many forms and you wouldn't be able to dictate what is what and when is when you wouldn't be able to it'll come right there and you wouldn't even see it coming you wouldn't even understand in the moment what is happening but there's a future that is being written from that very moment so yes do not look at yourself as less of a person because you're not pulling your own weight. The fact that you're trying to should be a valid enough reason. It should be such a standpoint reason. You're trying to improve. You're trying to change. As long as you're constantly doing that and improving in your mind, in your heart, and in your spirit, then you're okay. See, there's other people that do things they don't want to do. They wake up and they do things they don't want to do. And for the most part, it's a battle, you know, because I would say in a way that that's kind of my scenario. I wake up and I go to work. Do I want to work that? No. Do I want to do that? No. But I do it because it's a sacrifice. I do it because it'll be a foundation towards what I want in the future. It's a foundation towards what I want to do, what I want to become in the future. You know? It's a foundation of finance. 
as long as you have that ground you can branch off to anything a tree don't blossom through the air a tree starts at the root it starts in the earth you gotta get down before you go up you know what I'm saying hopefully that made sense I don't know if that made any sense but it made sense in my head but yeah relax stop being so hard on yourself okay I'm talking to you one on one stop being so hard on yourself first lay a blueprint out what do you have to do what do you have to fix what do you do what do you do what do you do to become the future version of yourself to become the better version of yourself the future version of yourself does not have to be 20 years later it does not have to be 5 years later it could be literally a minute later the future version of yourself could be 30 seconds later the future version of yourself is always in motion it's always changing it's right now one second two seconds five seconds that's the future version of yourself the thoughts the mind the imagination the creativity it all plays a role into your future self the way you speak to others the way you carry yourself the clothes you wear the things you listen to the things you say it all plays a part into what is and what will be your future self so you don't understand this and you're not you're not you're not thinking about this in the moment but it's all happening in one motion it all collects through the subconscious mind and it lays it out the future obviously i don't expect everybody to be conscious about this i mean at this at the same time nobody is really conscious about this stuff happening you're just living life and you're doing you but try to be more cautious and conscious of the words you say of the actions you do of the thoughts that you think of the you know way you carry yourself the way you treat others be more conscious about these things and i can guarantee you that your future self and your present self even will be at a more positive stance to will be at a more relaxed state of living a state of zen when you're more conscious about the things you say and you don't act on impulse and you don't act on emotion you're more conscious you're stronger than the average person because you're thinking before you speak you know not a lot of people do that a lot of people tend to react through, uh, through emotion and that's not good that's how you lose be conscious stay conscious stay strong learn what to say understand what to do and overall as a whole be conscious of what you say and what you do and I know the video is about future self but do not live too too far ahead in the future stay in this live in this presence but dream about the future live in the present dream about the future take change towards your future take action now today whatever you're doing i don't know do t t give me 20 push-ups do 20 push-ups right now take action right now i'll do 20 push-ups for you i don't mind I don't mind at all. I don't mind at all. I do it right here. Can you see me? Look. Now you better go. It's ten. That's twenty. Take change, man. <laughs> Y'all gotta understand. I'm being more. I'm being more interactive, ain't I? But y'all gotta understand that whatever I just did, those 20 push-ups, literally altered something, something, something in the uh, towards my future. It's weird how it works, isn't it? You don't think about that like that. But you don't think about these things. You don't. You don't. But everything you do, everything you say, every action plays a part in what will be you. Everything. Understand this. I'm trying to get you to understand this and grasp this. You need to take care of yourself. You need to treat yourself. You need to speak positive of yourself. Be 
because if you do you will benefit yourself you will gift yourself you will help yourself do not speak ill of self self is always listening you speak ill of yourself your body will literally turn against you your mind will literally turn against you your thoughts will turn against you practice on becoming a better person practice on becoming wiser more conscious practice on acting through self-control through consciousness don't act on emotion so much of course there needs to be that balance but do not act on emotion every single time when you're conscious and you think conscious you can understand and you can dictate when to act on emotion do not always act on emotion this is a universe and a planet of masculine and feminine energy learn to balance the two yin and yang symbolism you know everything has to have a balance learn to master the balance within yourself learn to balance your thoughts learn to balance your body learn to balance everything inside you and outside of you you are the dictator of your world you are the creator of your world the things you say the things you do the people you talk to it all plays a balance and it all plays a role towards your future self so please take care of yourself please take care of yourself that's all i ask but yes uh that'll conclude my speech for today my lecture i hope everybody liked it i hope you enjoyed it if you made it this far thank you i love you so much um and of course as always if the sun has just risen i hope you have a good day i hope you have a good experience i hope you have a great experience forget the good i hope you have a great experience and if the sun has just fallen and the moon has risen, I hope you have a good night. I hope you have some good messages. I hope you have some great dreams. And I hope you get some great rest. Thank you once again. And if you made it this far, once again, hey. Uh, I guess make sure to uh, show support, please. It, I would greatly appreciate it. Share the video, like it, whatever. It doesn't matter to me. Um, Yeah. I'll see you guys when I see you guys, which will be very soon. So thank you, take care, and I love you.